Now then YouTube, I am the Softman. Welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft Solitary Craft Modern City Challenge. Um, we're still in Phase 3, but we only have the one challenge left of Phase 3 before we move on to Phase 4, which is uh, where the interesting stuff uh, really does start happening, I believe. Um, so, what we're going to do in this episode is concentrate on that schoolhouse that we need to do. So let's pop over to that schoolhouse right now. Um, let's get some food out, because I'm getting hungry. Ah. In fact, I don't know if it's getting night. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch, it is. Right, so let's let's pop home. Don't know why I'm going towards the home, because I've, I've done this trip plenty of times. I can't wait to get started with some railcraft, guys, so that I can get a little bit of a train station. I just pop in, go, get to my stuff, you know, pop out, pop back in, come back home. Everything's going to be nice and sorted. Um, eventually, that's how it's going to be. That is definitely how it's going to be. Anyway, guys, what I'm going to do is go to, go to sleep really, really quickly, and uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. To start on the schoolhouse then, upgrade your schoolhouse to a high school. It must have at least two classrooms with at least two bookshelves in each. It must also have a dormitory, cafeteria, and principal's office. Okay, so we're going to need a lot of wood. Luckily, I do have a lot of wood. That's good, of course. Uh, I'm also going to take some logs as well, for just in case I'm going to need any more. I'll have it then when I'm out. Uh, I'll also put that door down eventually. Um, and get my sword out, because there could be something around here that uh, we don't want around here. Um, I don't have an axe. That could be uh, very difficult when working around the trees. Do I have an axe in my... My thing in here, or have I not? Did I put it in here, or did I lose it? I must have used it. Um, oh, I've already got some sticks there. Uh, I don't think there's much point in making an iron axe, to be honest. So what I'm going to do is go and make myself an axe. Nice. You keep doing your stuff, pigs. Making me more pigs. Making me more food. I'm running out on food, so make sure you hurry up with it. Pop over here and make myself a uh, an axe. That will help. Get rid of the trees that are around the uh, the primary school at the minute, so I can make it a little bit bigger. Pop that there. Pop that there. Good stuff. Oh, nice. Very nice indeed. Uh, in fact, while I'm here, I might as well cut the rest of that logs up, haven't I? Otherwise, things could get a little bit hairy. Put that in there. And get a whole load of wood out. Uh, I think this will be enough for the schoolhouse. Um, I've got to actually think about, you know, I'm going to need chairs, I'm going to need some desks. Uh, do we do desks, actually? Is there a desk? No, well, there's a writing desk, but there isn't an actual desk desk from Jammy's Furniture Mod. Um, so it looks like it's going to have to be the table from Jammy's Furniture Mod. Okay, sticks and um, and wood. So we've got two classrooms, okay. Um, we've got Wilson in one of them. We're going to need a pumpkin as well for the second teacher. Uh, two classrooms, two bookshelves. That's, that's pretty easy. I can get the bookshelves sorted pretty easily. Um... Dormitory needs beds, of course, and I haven't got any bloody wool, which is why I was getting that um, string. That's exactly the reason why I was getting that string. Unfortunately, I've only got two bits of string. That's not enough to make any beds. Um, cafeteria, maybe... Oh, what can I do with cafeteria? I could make a couple of tables, maybe. A couple of tables with a few chairs, um, and have maybe, I don't know, a... a a table like structure on one side just to represent the kitchen side of it uh, we need a furnace of course for that so let's get a furnace on the go uh, let's create some sticks three let's go with six six tables Stackable, so that's good. Um, I need chairs. 
Now, I want four chairs around the one table. Um, there it is. Look. Nah. What chair is that? So what chair is that? No idea, but we're going to go with this one anyway. Two sticks and three bits of wood. Need some more sticks. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we've got six chairs there, but I want eight, so. Let's get this sorted. It's good to have the materials ready with me, so I don't have to keep coming going backwards and forwards all the time. I'm gonna want a couple of levers, of course, for the uh for the teacher's arms. Um bit of fence post, but I think I've already got the fence in my invent in my uh, chests of uh, at home. But just to make sure that I'm not messing anything up, I'm going to make another bit of fence right now. Just to make sure that everything's there. Um, I've got six desks there. Uh, the furnace. What else would I want? What else could I possibly want from the furniture mod? Let's have a look. Where is the furniture stuff? You can't really miss it. Where is the furniture stuff? Come on. There it is. Right, what are you doing in here, pig? Sink? No, I don't need a sink. Uh, lamp, chimney, cooker? Okay. Oh, furnace with some iron around it. Okay, I can do that. I've got iron in here. I'm sure I have. Instead of using the the furnace as a cooker, I can actually use a cooker as a cooker. Which makes sense, really. So let's pop this around there. And grab ourselves a cooker. What else have we got in here that we can use? Maybe a kitchen sink? Oops. Which is ceramic panels with a with a with uh, an iron ingot here. What, what do we do? Unfired ceramic panel. Clay. Uh, I don't think I have any clay at the minute, so that's unfortunate. Um, what's all this here? Uh, mantel pieces, kitchen cupboards, kitchen sides, um, wooden planks, and iron. What, what do we do with this? Ah, oh, it's pretty simple, really, isn't it? Is that wood wood type specific? It looks like it's wood type specific. So what I'm going to do um, is don't. Don't go mad at me here because I'm, uh, you know, this is. I've got wood. I'm just not pissing about going out and finding loads more. Uh, I'm just gonna get half a stack, put that in there, um, grab a full stack out, put another half a stack in there as well. So basically, I've just got half stacks. There we are. It is wood type specific. Okay. Let's get a couple of uh, kitchen sides. I need some iron for some kitchen cupboards for this cafeteria. Oh no. Run out of room. Let's put that in there. We've done a good job here. We've done a good job so far. I'm sure we've got some uh, pumpkins at home so I don't need to mess around doing anything like that. I don't want to use that. Okay, two kitchen cupboards as well then. If we need anything else, I will come back, but I'm sure we'll be okay for the moment. Now then, pig, you will die. Get here. Get here, son of a bitch. Could have given me a pork chop. Come on. Where, where, where's your... Where's your food? Give me it. Give me it. Right, let's start on this... Uh, I have a wooden axe. I th I'm sure I made a stone one. Never mind. Never mind. Let's go and sort all this out then. And uh, we'll see what we're going to be doing in here. Okay, well what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a another class off in this direction, I reckon. So I'm going to want to get rid of this tree. Boosh! Gone. Oh, I can't pick anything up. Um, it's a bit annoying having this here, I've got to tell you. Nothing much I can do about it. I mean, I suppose I could step down into the class. 
that needs to come out anyway. And it's not all on one plane then, you know what I mean? It doesn't look boring and square and all on one plane when you're looking at it. It's uh, going everywhere. Here, there and everywhere, that's good stuff. That's good stuff. Uh, mind you, actually, I do need to build the floor, so it's probably going to end up all on one plane. Come on. It's going to be pretty similar size, I reckon. I think that size will do quite nicely. Yeah, yeah, that'll be fine. Let's get rid of this, do this. Um, where's the front? Here's the front. Oh, I never finished what I've started. <laughs> right, let's get that dug out. There we are. Um, then it uses that side as a wall there as well, so that's good. Rather than having to put two walls in, what's the point in that? When you can just use one as the other. getting dark again, is it? It is. I'm not having that. We are close to getting things sorted with the second classroom. We need to go into our house as well and get that pumpkin. But what I'm going to need to do now is pop inside and sleep throughout the night. And what I will be is back in the morning... And just to make sure that I do have a pumpkin. Ah, I've got plenty of pumpkins sticking around, so that's good. I'm going to sleep through the night. I'm probably going to sort my inventory out, and then I will be back in the morning. I've just sorted my inventory out to give myself a little bit more space, and we are going back outside, getting rid of the spider, and hopefully gaining some string from that. Yes, good stuff. We need the string to uh, to get us some beds for the dormitory of course. I think what I'm going to do is maybe work towards maybe getting four beds in the dormitory. I think that's uh, more than enough right at the start. We're just going to sort all this, this little bit of wheat out that's here. Oops. Replant some of this. And redo that. And then fill up that thing with some wheat again because I think it's run out. Yeah, it has. Right, somebody's eaten one of them already. Um, right, the school looking's good. It's looking good so far. Coming over here and into the second classroom. Which at the moment is... Oh, that's glitched. Um, let's get this... Let's get a top on this. I've just realised that none of my school rooms have windows, so my kids are going to be bleary eyed when they come out to play. Um, unfortunately, I'm not doing anything about that just now, uh, but the only thing I'm going to do is put down some torches. I think that's the only thing I'm going to do just now. What I will do, uh, I'm going to need some stairs, much like these here. Um, I think I put my desk and my chairs inside ready for when I was ready, but I, I think I'm ready now, so <laughs> it's quite pointless. Uh, okay, there's the desks, chairs, tables, cooker. I think we're okay. I did that. I still have some steps. That's great news. That's great news. Knew I had some kicking around somewhere. I'll also go and harvest some sugar cane at some stage because I'm going to need to make another bookcase. Well, I'm going to need three bookcases, so that's quite a, quite a fair bit. Uh, now the teacher in this classroom is going to face the other way. That's right, fellas. He's going to face the other way. I'm also going to put him like that. Uh, the, the thing with pumpkins... Is, oh, my goodness, I've forgotten a pumpkin. Yeah, I have. The thing with putting pumpkins on sticks is the fact that you need... Uh, you need to place the pumpkin on a solid block first, and I'll show you what I mean. Even though I'm not doing it, uh, I'll show you what I mean. 
Uh, let's grab another one for the cafeteria. I suppose we need a dinner lady. Right, let's pop in here, and I'll show you. What, I'll show you what I mean. You can see at the moment that you've got a fence that's uh, plonked on a block with two arms and and the head there. Uh, and what I'm going to do, but the thing is, if you wanted to, like, I'm just going to show you because I tried doing this and it just never worked. I don't know if they fixed it, but uh, still, where is my fence? There it is. If you put a fence post down like that and then try to put a, uh, a pumpkin directly on the top of it, it just won't work. So, a little trick is to put a solid block down, like wooden planks say for example, then put the pumpkin on top of it, knock the solid block out and then put the fence post down on the bottom. But of course, I mean we're not doing that anyway, that's not the point. Uh, we're going to put that down there, we're also going to get one of the dark wood planks for there. And there we have another teacher. Now then, a uh, desk, or in this case, a table, and a chair. Oh, that's another table. Chair. No, that's the wrong way. Fair enough. There we are, and there is another classroom. We just need three more bookcases now, and that'll be another classroom done. So let's go over to my sugarcane farm over here and harvest off some sugarcane. And I'm glad I've been growing this as I've been going along, because now I can just do this, and I'll have tons of sugarcane all the time. And at some stage, I'm going to want to get a forestry sugarcane farm going, just for the fun of it. Uh, plenty of sugar cane there, but I'm gonna have to go over to my crafting area to go and make um, Go and make those bookcases bit annoying, but still Aha. That's more like it give me your meat Good stuff right. Let's go over and, and, and get these bloody things crafted And hopefully get phase three sorted. Maybe in the next episode, I'm not going to be able to build the uh, the cafeteria in this one. I'm sure, and the dormitories, of course. I've still got to get the string together. Right, so let's get this sugar cane made into some papers. There, and. Let's make these into books. Nine books. I'm sure, whoever it is outside. Who is it? Sounds like they're literally outside. Right, anyway. Well, that's good. We have enough to make the bookcases. Jerry, shut up. We have enough to make the bookcases and another one, an extra one, just to, you know, maybe for later on. Good stuff. Let's pop back to the schoolhouse, place these bookshelves down and cross that off the list of things to do. We also need a principal's office, I forgot about that, but uh, we will get to that soon, I'm sure. I might make a little bit of a clock or something for the principal's office, just to make it stand out from uh, a teacher's classroom, maybe. I'll also do a table and I'll put the uh I'll put the little teacher thing behind the table rather than, you know, at the front of the class like what these are. If I put a table maybe uh, a big long three table and then put one of these behind it, it may look okay. So let's get these down. Couple of bookcases there. Couple of bookcases there. Bob's your uncle Fanny is your aunt. Now to work on the con. Eh. Would I? Uh, where to go to the cafeteria? I'd like to make a big long like corridor, maybe. So uh, why is this further back? Son of a bitch! What I would like to do is change that around there. I'm gonna need to get rid of this. 
which is fine. Ah, oh, well it's not because I can't actually get out about grab hold of any. Uh, I'm just going to build along here because what I want to do maybe is like a a big corridor going down the middle of the school here that allows you to get into all the classrooms as well as then on the other side of the corridor maybe getting into subsequent classrooms and also getting into principal's office and ways up to get to the dormitory which is going to be upstairs by the way I'm not going to do a, a, a low level dormitory I think I'm going to do one upstairs um, what we're going to need to do though is something about this because it isn't right but that's fine I can start that out pretty easily just like ah oh, damn you just like this whip that over there okay so now we've got an entrance into there I want an entrance into here as well but I want it right on the edge of the classroom so right there and what I'm gonna do is just go down and knock out all this here so that it doesn't look too, totally stupid just knock this out I think we're getting close to the end of the episode, guys, which is unfortunate because I'm enjoying myself. Just pop this along. I don't like it when things aren't the way that they should be. Ah, one thing actually. There's a, an odd piece that I always use to start off the roof that needs to go in. I hate it when there's little bits left that I've missed out. Right, I think that's looking pretty good. I'm thinking two doors here. I'm thinking the corridor here. Um, the corridor is not actually going to be that big. Uh, with a roof along the top. There. Feel free to mock my designing skills. You know, I'm not an architect. I don't know the layout of things, but this is what I would do the choice were down to me and it is so it's a bit tough um, have I got the light wood there again I haven't I I don't want that that's just silly and it is getting dark guys I'm probably gonna end the episode right here um, I'm gonna pop home actually first I'm gonna end the episode there and what I will do is in the next episode, I really should be getting close to finishing Phase 3. If not the next episode when I finish Phase 3, it will be definitely the episode after that. I still have a principal's office, a dormitory, and a cafeteria to build in the schoolhouse. But things are coming together quite nicely. Until next time, guys, I've been the Tough Man, and as always, stay safe.